Hey guys, Jim from Team Bring Infinity with. Hey bro, it's Devlon. And we're sh doing a little double thing. I've got my Silver Thorn right here, my budget build. And it's a lot of fun, and I updated it from the last time I did it. There's only like literally three card differences. Um, so let me just go into the deck. And Ionella, if you don't remember from last time, she's very much the booster for the, rest, for the whole game. Every time you have a Silverthorn Pebble Vanguard and it hits while it's boosted, then you check top two and then put a Silverthorn Soul and then a rest go to bottom. So pretty much miscellaneous. Um, then you got the four and the four. I just don't have, I just don't have more of these, but it doesn't really I don't really, really use the skill, but it's still the, it's still just a crit. Hey, you can trip people when thinking you play 12. Actually, that could. Actually, that's happened before. <laughs> but then they saw the draws, and then they're like, oh, so I just fell for that. <laughs> um, and 4 heal. The funniest thing about this deck, there's really no special counter boss, so I don't even know why I even care about not running, I mean, running all these crits. I mean, um, all these specified. Silver Thorn cards, because it doesn't really matter. Yeah, throw on a popcorn board and you'll be good. <laughs> Actually, I'm just saying, like, I, I can use the um, Rainbow Magician, but it, but this is better because it's 5k. Rainbow Magician is 4k. And, and, doesn't, and it's not hysteric, surely. <laughs> uh, then we got four... I, I Ar arena. Arena. Arena, whatever. Arena, she is pretty much... When she puts on Vanguard, Rear Guard, and you have a Silver Thorn Vanguard. Um, then you check the top two, and then... You search for a silver thorn among them, put them in the soul. It's pretty obvious. It happens a lot. And then we got the four PGs, because PGs are PGs. Lolly. Then we got three to 10k attack and breathing dragon. Um, duh. 10k attacker. And fuck. And I will be serious. Fuck Anna. Anna sucks. This is the best card. You cannot place Pale Move out this anymore. I don't. I've gone through testing with Devon, and this is just this just seems much. Funny fact that I gave the idea. Yes. I don't know. Thank what, you, man. I don't know how. Because actually, just, that's actually that's why I, I've been looking from other decks that. I will try to piece this. They're yes, because she's Anna. needed. Because fucking Anna sucks. She's not any help. She's a, she's just a smaller version of pretty much, this card right here. But it's not as good. Because it's a fucking set. I got to that card later. Uh, I did get yeah, into the care yeah, yeah. Um, 12k attacker, um, rising dragon. Three 10k attackers. Three Mars CCO, which is pretty much the better Anna. When she hits a vanguard while she's vanguard or rearguard, so vanguard or rearguard, then I counter boss one, and then I call it a silver thorn for my soul, and then it goes back into the soul at the end of, end of the turn. And then two fire breath carry, just because I, I feel like I, this deck kind of needs some draw. Can I read her name? Fire breeze, okay. Fire breeze carry. Before you put, you said silver breath. <laughs> then you now you say fire breath, and this it's really fire breeze. I don't care for her name. She's just the fucking leave me alone. Four. These will be gone soon because they're ugly to look at. I really hate looking at proxies. Um, but just look okay. at this one. I, mean, I, got, I got a $60 tab on me while you already have your cards. Anyway, counter boss one, lock one, and you call it a, any pale moon rear guard from your, I mean, any pale moon from your soul, and it gets plus five until the end of the turn. And then plus two if I get the other bitch in here, but I don't play the other bitch. Because she's not good. Because she's fucking 10k. I mean, if it was something like a mon, it's just like, oh look, I gained a thousand for everything in my fucking soul. But no, I have to counter bust three for her stupid skill, and that's not worth shit. And then three break ride. I don't have a fourth, but it's just like it's just as fine because you don't really like, because lots of these skills need to be given given off by um having a silver thorn vanguard. So, I mean, I will play four, but it's just like it's still fine with three. And this, if you still haven't figured this out by now, attack, soul charge one, and it gains one, and it's mandatory. And when you break out on top of it, it gives the vanguard plus ten, and then when the vanguard gains a skill, when it attacks, then you put two pound moons from your rearguard circle, and then put them out to the, um, rearguard. Put them in the, yeah, wow. 
You put two out from the rear guard circle, put them in soul, then you call you call two more. And it can be the same ones, which is why you definitely need to play this, because this is the best combo in the world. You have two out, then you just pull, pull out two, then you put these the two front rows back in, and then you already have your columns back. Best combo in the world. If it was Anna. <laughs> no one needs to know about Anna. Anna sucks. But that's it for you guys. Hope you guys like this video and subscribe to Team Bring It for more content. So see you guys later, Jalen and uh, Devlon. Going out. See you later.